it's another match day vlog and this time i am in portugal i've just arrived outside the stadium uh, i've came down from faro with my brother and his mate um, and we're also meeting up with a benfica fan um, but yeah it's hopefully going to be a really good game for the reds um, excitement already stadium looks boss in the background as well but uh, let's go and see some of the atmosphere let's go and have a look around and uh, before we do get into the match day vlog um, please do like this video and also subscribe to the channel. Up the Reds! Um, and I do something now, uh, I'll get some uh, predictions, score predictions, but I am very stereotypical. I don't like predicting games before um, kick-off, I hate it. So hopefully this one won't go against us. I'll ask Sean first, who is obviously his Irish support in the Reds. Uh, who's going to win? What's the score? Ah, look, you know, I've got to back the Reds, but I don't think it's going to be all uh, one-way traffic. Like. No. 2-1 two, two I reckon, you know? 2-1 I hope I'm wrong, I hope we win 4-0 but... Only if away goals actually meant something I mean yeah, yeah, more 2-1 yeah, I reckon, two they put up a good fight 2-1 you know? I'm going to go with 3-0 um, to Liverpool I can't, can't have us not winning uh, I probably won't be speaking during the game because I'll be surrounded by a load of Portuguese fans um, but you know, if we do score, I will have a bright smile on my face uh, Bro, what are your score positions for the game? Yeah, I reckon 3-0, I think First half, they'll come out strong the first 10 minutes just with the atmosphere. And I think, to be honest, as soon as we get a goal, that'll Kill dampen it. them down. Yeah. Yeah. And then they'll have to come out a bit more, even more so than when they've, with that first 10 minutes of the atmosphere. I think 2 0 half time, 1 0 second half, 3 0 overall. 3 0 squads. Uh, first starting. goal, I'm going to say Salah, as always. Then I'll say um, Luis Diaz. I think he'll then take them off, and I think second half we'll get Jota. one through Jota when he comes yeah. on. And uh, Marcio here, who we've came with is a Benfica fan. Um, you're backing your lads. You gotta back Hello. you gotta back the Benfica men. Yes. yes. One nil. One nil Benfica. Is enough. One nil. Who's scoring? Yes. Who is scoring? Nunes. Nunes? So thank you. Qual o jogador? Qual o jogador? Uh, busy is is play. Right. Yeah. Right. Well, uh, hopefully the red men and by red men, I don't know what we're in, but we're not in red. I can tell you that. Uh, but hopefully Liverpool do uh, win the game. Give us an advantage into the second leg. I don't care what advantage it is. Just give us something. Um, but yeah, I can't wait for this game of football. Let's get into it.
the rest of the yards to turn to this stage. Didn't quite break me to be honest. just got back from the game it is past 3 a.m in the morning we had a long drive back down uh, to where we're staying but uh, what a game of football uh, the first half we played uh, much better than the second um second half we let them into the game uh, an error by uh, Kanata at the back caused them to to get a goal it brought the fans back into it um and we were on the back foot for a lot of the second half to be honest it caused us a lot of troubles um but they didn't really deserve anything out the game. Um, we had so many chances. It should have been three or four by half time, and we didn't put the tie to bed. But uh, we go and get that killer goal um, in the last couple of minutes of the game to take a two goal advantage back to Liverpool. And uh, hopefully, we can increase on that score at Liverpool. Hopefully, it is a good game. Um, the atmosphere was was fairly good in the ground. It was a great experience. A great. Um, a great stadium to be fair it was absolutely brilliant i also said at the beginning that it was around eighty thousand. someone told me a lie it's sixty five thousand. Uh, i went and searched it um but yeah a, a great stadium great atmosphere uh, and a great victory for the red men um, and now obviously onto a massive game in manchester city on sunday which hopefully i'll have a match reaction for um but I'll probably feel extremely ill with nerves, to be honest. So uh, let's see how that one goes on. Um, but what a time to be a red. Uh, two of uh, the games in April now done. Uh, two wins. Hopefully the run continues. Till the next one. Up the Reds.